ay alam land hotels and resorts entered into the hospitality business in Palawan in 2010. This was first done through the acquisition of a company called Ten Nuts. We moved into a purchase of 300 plus hectares of land in a small place called Leo. And that's where we have started to develop a fully integrated mixed-use development. Getting the things done is a little more difficult to do it on an isolated island like Palawan. But we've been able to do it through our work with the local community. Since our entry into 2010, we have about 400 employees working for us now. 90% of that are actually locals from Palawan. We want it to be inclusive, creating jobs, giving them businesses, allowing them not to have to leave their locality. I'm uh, Bernadette Olanday, taga El Nido po ako. mag 11 years na ako ng September 1. Kinukonvince ko sila na dati naman laundry ako, dati naman masahista ako, kaya natin. Why do they need to leave the country when we can provide them opportunities for employment and opportunities for business? We always like to develop our employees na holistic. We're inviting external speakers to speak about financial stability, savings. Abili ako ng lupa at ang plano ko ay yun, magpatayo ako ng boarding house sa kinikita ko na naman ngayon. Naniniwala kami na pag-align ang mission, vision, and values mo sa buhay dun sa mission, vision, and values ng kumpanya ay uh, mas productive kang employee. We're requiring 46 hours per employee and then five years for managers to conduct the training. Marami naman silang trainings, basic life support, customer service, basic management. Adi develop ako unti unti pa paano humarap ng tama, paano makipag-usap sa mga tao ng maayos. El Nido Resorts has won um, just in 2016 11 awards, seven of them which are foreign. And it's the service of the people that are being recognized for it. Ecotourism ang ating business eh, so we're relying on the resources, on the environment. So I think it is but proper for the company na palaguin ang pamumuhay ng mga tao dito. Ako si Danny Lopez, 48 years old, 25 years old na pa ako nag-supply ng seafood sa resort. Alimango, talaba, tsaka yung clams. Alimawa, isang araw, umodol sila ng 50 kilos na alimango, 50 kilos na alimasag, 200 na oyster, 200 din na clams. Nakakapundar din po ng kontinti. Bumili ako ng pambot para mas mabilis makarating at deliver ng maaga. Malaking tulong sa amin yung resort. Dahil nakakasupply kami ng permanente. We take time to find out what the community needs so that we make the community grow together. It's really educating them to elevate them to a standard wherein we can actually compete globally. It has been able to lower our costs. It's really efficiency of management and efficiency in time delivery. The other goal is really to build a town, but in El Nido, it's really a tourism estate. We are only consuming about 44 hectares out of the 300 hectares. So we will continue to expand that 44 into the 325, and that will create more demand. El Nido Resorts was uh, recognized by the World Travel and Tourism Council. We have been recognized internationally for really working with the community and being part of the community in El Nido, Palawan.